Hi, I'm Megan. Today we're going to go over some directional terms. These are terms that are going to be used when you're taking radiographs or when you're describing where a wound is, so it's important that you know them, understand them, and use them in your everyday vocabulary. So we'll start with the easy ones, dorsal and ventral. Dorsal is kind of along the spine, this side of the dog, and I like to think of it like a dorsal fin on a shark. And ventral is the abdominal side, so dorsal, ventral. We also have cranial and caudal. So cranial is towards the head, caudal is towards the tail. So if you're describing um, a mass that's kind of along the spine, you can say it's caudal or cranial, depending on which direction you're thinking. We also have dorsal and palmar. So when you're talking about radiographs on the limbs, this is the dorsal side on the top here, and palmar is underneath. So think of your own palm, so dorsal, palmar here. We also have distal and proximal. Distal is farther away from the body, so this is the distal end of this leg. Proximal is closer, so we're proximal. You can be distal to the stifle, proximal to the stifle. We also have medial and lateral. Medial is closer to the center, so when we're, we have this dog laying on our side, we can have the medial, which would be the inside, or the lateral, which is the outside here. So when we have the saphenous veins, this is the lateral saphenous, the medial saphenous is going to be on the inside here. Then we have rostral, which is towards the nose. So if you're, you know, say you're taking a radiograph of the head and the doctor says we need to get more rostral, then you know you need to get more of the nose in. And that's it. Did I get all of them? <laughs>